A car traveling at 22.4 meters per second skids to a stop in 2.55 seconds. Determine the skidding distance of the car. Let's assume uniform acceleration. Well, in this case, I have this given, which talks about velocity initial of my car. And then this word to a stop tells me that my velocity final is zero meters per second. I know finally that the time is 2.5 seconds. Since this is happening in the X, I'll do it in red. Velocity initial equals 22.4 meters per second. My velocity final equals 0 meters per second. And the amount of time doesn't have a direction, so I'll put that in black. 2.55 seconds. The thing that I don't know is the distance in the x-axis. That's in meters per second. Whoops, that's in meters. And the equation that I'm going to use is distance equals one-half the velocity final plus the velocity initial times time. I don't know what distance is, so I'm going to write the variable equals all of this over 2, but that equals velocity final, which is 0, plus 22.4, that's my initial velocity, times 2.55. Distance equals 22.4 times 2.55 divided by 2. Distance equals 57.12 divided by 2. Distance equals 28.56 meters. Take a look at significant figures. It looks like I need three significant figures. So I get 28.6 meters.